Aloha everybody. All right, we are here in Hawaii and here is the PowerWorks 160W solar array. These are nice because they have a 45 degree angle tilt to them. Very well designed. You've got these little straps basically. These fold up the size of a small little carry-on suitcase. It's very small. And then in here we've got the PowerWorks MPPT. It's an MPP tar charger. So this here is the charger for it. This is the MPPT 314.6. It takes a while to charge this. Keep in mind, again, this is solar panel. So, let me solar charge, excuse me. This is the Bieno Power Lithium Ion Phosphate. It's the uh, 20 amp, 240 watt battery. And this is a really, really good battery for your ham radio. It's going to last for quite a while. How you hook it up is outside the charger, outside the uh, solar panel, panel, excuse me, will come a wire. The wires are marked exactly for the charge controller, okay? Notice here that these say that they go to the, they go to the panels, right? So it tells you these go to the power bolt, power input, okay? So that's your panels. Here it goes to the battery. So you can't make a mistake. Just use the Anderson power poles and it connects right there to the piano. It takes about three to 10 hours to fully charge the battery. I know it's a long time. So this is one of those projects you just kind of leave alone. You let it charge. You just kind of do your own thing. Come back, everything's charged up and you're ready to go. So that's the uh, Bieno battery for ham radio. I think you can get this. I think it's $299 for the Bieno now. Uh, it will deliver 20 amps of continuous charge. Keep in mind, most radios don't use that much. If you're, you know, if you're just receiving, you're using about three to four amps, but when you're transmitting, you're gonna go up to 20, 22 amps. So that's, you know, that's gonna be using that battery a little harder, but it still will work just fine. Whether you're using the ICOM 7300 or you're using like a FTDX 10 or a, uh, maybe a Kenwood 590 turbo golf, something like that. That's the Bieno Power BLF 1220A. It's a Life Po 4 battery. And again, it's got a good one year warranty on it. And uh, that, that is the solar panel battery. And the solar panels with the charge controller. Very important. Hook it up first. Panels to charge controller, charge controller to battery. That's how it goes. Do not hook your rig straight up to this. Let it just charge the battery. That's what it's designed for, okay? Again, solar panel to charge the battery. You take the battery with you on the road, hook it up. You've got the Anderson power poles to hook up to your power supply and away you go. But if you're on the road and you need to be able to get a quick charge and keep that battery going, hey, you just charge them right up with these panels and you are good to go. That's the Bieno LiPo battery and uh, the PowerWorks MPPT 300-14.6 along with the PowerWorks 160 watt solar panels. Pretty good. Total package for this is right about 450. Gives you everything you need to solar panel your rig.